Yo guys, Grady here. It's November 6th already. Wowee, I cannot believe that. I'm on a walk today with my dad and Robert and Julie. So, just going through the neighborhood. Currently, look at all these pine cones. Oh yeah, and check this out. This has an orange band around it right here. That signifies that parts of the tree got cut off up there because it was touching those power lines. But anyways, you know, same old stuff. Nice and chilly out today. Yeah, makes for a nice peaceful walk. My neck kind of hurts today for some odd reason, but you know, it's still a good day to be out walking. Um, and uh, what's that? It's a little piece of rock. See, that's cool. I'll keep that. Um, well. It is November 6th. Thanksgiving is coming up and then Christmas after that. Wow. We're already in the final stretch of the year, guys. That's incredible. Um, not too much has happened today. Spent the day at home. Um, and I, uh, as you saw in the last video, I have I um, applied for the volunteer position at the um, animal shelter in the next county over, one of the animal shelters over there. But um, I haven't heard back from them yet. Um, although, uh, a little tired. Ugh. I woke up really super late today, um, but it's been a good day so far. It's been a great day, actually. It's nice to end it with a peaceful walk. Ow. I can't keep turning my neck like that because that hurts. I don't know why it hurts. Maybe I slept funny or something, you know? Maybe that's what happened. I don't, I don't know. I really don't know. We've reached a quieter, well, I have reached a quieter part of the road. Robert and my dad are back there. Um, Julie's trailing off behind them. She probably won't go the full length. I don't know if I will for that matter either, but, um, been a pretty good day um, just you know all this stuff that's happened today has been pretty great for me at least I've um, I've been able to get some video editing done I was able to um, review some videos that I uploaded in the past and all that so that's pretty good <sighs> oh, excuse me oh excuse me Got to remember to cover my mouth when I do that. And yeah, I am working, but I will be um, saying this, guys. There aren't going to be as many nature walks for a while. There will still be some, but not as many because we're in a situation right now, my family and I, where we've only got two cars. Look at the sunset. It's over there. Pretty, isn't it? incredible um, but anyways we've um, only got two cars right now and I'll be able to do it on the days where I'm picked up at 2 30 because hopefully 
on those days I'll be getting home before it gets too dark and then I'll um, be able to uh, keep filming these for you guys but um, it gets dark now at like um, 4, 4.30 so you know when I get home especially from the days where I um, get picked up at 4.30 from work it's really gonna be hard for me to do nature walk videos so I'll be doing other videos from inside my house or from wherever I happen to be so um, that's what's been happening and sorry if I look like I'm crying I'm just really tired today which is weird because <laughs> it's actually a funny story. I got up really late today. I woke up this morning and checked my phone and I'm like, oh my goodness, it's 11.16. So yeah, I got up at 11.16 a.m. this morning. It's now about, mm, it's a little after. Uh, I shouldn't have said earlier that it got dark at like 4.30 because it's like 4.30 now, so still is a good time to go walking I'm enjoying myself going walking at this time of day um, my dad and Robert will catch up eventually but um, it's really been interesting going on walks these past couple of weeks and just noticing you know like the weather and everything and how that's been changing um, but it's nice and peaceful. Yeah, there are some cars off in the distance because the main road is right over, right over that way a little bit. But um, that's not gonna, you know, deter me from going on walks. It isn't. I um, I um, will still do the nature walks. Hopefully, I'll do one on Thanksgiving. I can get out and do one either while I'm at home or while I'm up with family, or maybe both, if I'm lucky. And, you know, that'll be fun. My, um, my, um, videos are doing well over on my main channel. They're doing well over on this one too. Um, but, you know, I know that it's gonna take some time and patience, of course. That's what it takes all the time, is time and patience. And we, um, wow, it's pretty chilly out tonight. Didn't think it was gonna get quite this cold, but I'm not shivering or anything. I can handle this, I'm Danish. Bring it on, cold, bring it on. I don't really care how much it brings it on anyways. I love the cold. I go nuts for it. But yeah, it's really been, here we go guys. The woods up there. Pretty cool. Zoom in a little bit. Zoom in a little bit more. Those are the woods. But anyways, um, <clears throat> look at the mountains. So pretty. So glistening and white. Rosalie's a little hard to see right now. I should have pointed the camera at her earlier. Ah, there she is. It's kind of hard to see her. Let me zoom in, then maybe you can see her better. It's hard to see her. But she's there. She's a little covered by clouds, which is good. I'm telling you, fall out here 
gets pretty cold and winter is even colder which is nice because as I've said before I love the cold and it's um it's really been interesting these past couple of years to watch the weather change because that's what I've been doing is watching the weather change a lot um, um, exactly a year ago it would have been at least 40 degrees warmer at this time of day during this time of year than it is right now so that's pretty good that it's getting colder it's good for me to get out and go on these walks you know it is it's good it's good for not only your standard health but your mental health too oh I feel so great tonight Whew. and I know that tomorrow is going to be a great day at work. Oh, Julie's still coming. That's good. We're um not quite halfway around yet. I'm further ahead than the others. Um, and, uh, well, it's just been... Ow. Gosh, my neck hurts badly. It's been interesting... Um, to see how the nature changed too, you know, from the leaves being on all the aspen trees to seeing them fall off like how they are right now. You guys will notice over the next several months that um, they'll be coming back at some point. They'll be coming back wait until it's around like March or so they'll come back um, the pine trees they just stay that way all year um, look see we still got the snow so yeah, the snow is still here. Now that's what I don't know when it's next supposed to snow. I think sometime later this week it's supposed to snow again, but I could be wrong on that. So don't hold me to that, because I could be wrong on that. Excuse me. What did I eat earlier? Oh yeah, I had burritos earlier. That's why I keep burping. Sorry about that, guys. Um, oh. It's um, it's really nice. Ooh, look at that. Doesn't the snow look great there? I know there's not much for me to talk about tonight, guys, but I'm setting all the political stuff aside for today, which is interesting because today is actually the midterms, the voting for the midterms in the country below Canada, so that's what it's like for today. Um, but setting all that aside, it's been a fantastic day. I've had a lot of fun getting out, you know. I'm, I'm enjoying, ow, really got to stop doing that. I'm enjoying learning French, so that's still going well. Um, it's easy to learn. It's fun. It's exciting. And makes me happy. And I'm still reading that really good book. I haven't been reading it like, ooh, it's been like maybe now about a week since I've read it, maybe less. Look at the clouds up there, guys. That color is so pretty. Um, 
But yeah, I'm gonna uh, read more of it today. So when I get home, <clears throat> so that'll be good. I need to get more reading done because it's a good book. And I've got quite a lot of other books actually that I should read that I still haven't read yet. It'll be great to read them too once I get to them. It'll be great to read them. I can't wait for that. That'll be nice. I love doing that. Reading books is fun for me. I, um, I'm still writing as well, writing books. That's going pretty well, thus far anyways. Now we're about a little more than halfway through. Look, there's ice on the ground. <laughs> And I'm not necessarily on the side of the road either. Ow. No matter which way I turn my neck. Ow, it hurts. I'll be all right though. I've gone through worse than that. Um, but, uh, it's been, see like this? This plant is almost entirely dead. I'm surprised. It isn't entirely dead, which is kind of weird up here. So, it's been interesting to see all these trees and such change over the years. It really has been, huh? What? Oh, I have no idea. Um, it's been interesting to watch it all change. You know? It's been fun to see all these different little changes. Ooh, look at this cool rock. See, isn't that neat? That looks pretty cool. So. You want to take the cut through the woods? Go all the way around. Okay. Um, thank goodness that we've been getting the colder weather. We've needed it really badly. Um, I'm walking on ice here, so that's why. Whoa, careful, Dad, I'm walking on ice. That's why you need to not use that thing this time of year. It's too long. Um, now we're cutting through the woods. That's what I do. Um, so, in just a second, these are the woods here. Skipping along now. And here we go. Going through the woods. It's, um... It's really great to be out here on such a peaceful evening. So, it's really nice here in the woods, see? We're walking through them. It's nice. Well guys, 
that's going to mark this video. So, um, thank you for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Have a peaceful day. Bye.